Panasonic GH5 uses the entire sensor width to capture an image. This is different than the GH4, which would crop in when shooting 4K video and give you a little more punched in look. So as we can see right now on this set, we've got our chip chart all the way out to the edge, right at the very edge of the framing, so we can show you how wide the framing is. But what if I need more zoom reach from the, the lens and I don't have any more focal length available? Or what if I wanted to use a lens that's designed for a smaller sensor? Well, our extended teleconverter function will give you a more punched in look on the sensor. Let me walk you through how to get that in the menu right now. So first we're going to press the menu button. Once we're in the menu, we need to go to that second tab that looks like a movie camera. And we need to be on page three of four. You'll see an option that says extended teleconverter. We're going to go ahead and turn that feature on. And once we've turned it on, we're going to press the record button and we'll start our recording. And once it's recording, what you'll see is that I no longer have that chip chart completely in frame. I'm now tighter framed on this shot. Now, if you want an even greater crop, what you can do is you could record in 1080 video. And what it'll do then is crop into a 1080 by 1920 image, giving you a very close crop. So at this point, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the cameras menu. Uh, we're going to go to page one of four. Again, we need to be on that second tab, the, the movie camera tab. Once we're there, you'll see an option for resolutions. We want to change this. In this case, we're going to change it to 1080. It'll be at 60 frames per second. And then once we have that changed, we'll start recording some video. And what you'll see is that we are really punched in now. It's basically just a shot of my head. Panasonic.